Michael Jordan will forever be known as one of the greatest, if not the greatest, players to touch a basketball. Michael Jordan had 11 seasons where he played over 80 games. This is where his training and weightlifting helped him excel on the floor. So the question everyone wants to know is, how did Michael Jordan train? And how can I, as a player, be like Mike? What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Shifty Dame. And I've made a video in the past of how to jump like Ja Morant, and you guys seem to love it. So in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to train like Michael Jordan. The man, the myth, the legend. And how you can implement his exercises into your daily regimen. Now, I've been watching a lot of Michael Jordan videos, and a video came across where his trainer, Tim Grover, who if you don't know already, is a talented trainer who has trained NBA talents like Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, Charles Barkley, Dwayne Wade, and many other sports stars. In the video, he basically broke down how he trained him and the work ethic that he had to put in. But Tim Grover never went in depth of how he trained these players. So, you know your boy Shifty Dame had to do a little research, find, and put the best routine for you guys to train as similarly to Michael Jordan as possible. Alright, when it comes to weight training, Tim Grover had Michael Jordan do exercises that would actually help him in a game. On the screen, you can see a full routine of a Sunday to Saturday lifting schedule that I've put together that looking at sources from Tim Grover has said and also analyzing videos of Michael Jordan working out. If you can't see the theme already, there's basically three upper days and two leg days. On every day, Tim Grover recommends three to five sets of five to six reps with two minute rest in between every set. Now, you can do more reps, but I recommend stay the same sets. On the upper days, you see standing dumbbell presses which would work on your shoulder and help durability of shooting a lot of shots on a daily basis. Bench press, curls, and the two other variations of presses are to build a solid foundation. On leg days, it's as basic as deadlift, squat, RDLs, calf raises, and power cleans. Now the power cleans can be done on either day because it's a full body workout, but I put it on lower because it can work in with deadlift, and you can do the deadlift and then the power clean right after. This just like an upper body, is to build a base of strong legs and to prevent injury. Michael Jordan's tip in his workout video is stretching. Quoting MJ, stretching is always important. I think you should always involve stretching with you, conditioning as well, as with your pre-workout routine. Now, going on with conditioning, this is the conditioning schedule that I've put together by looking at the source. Yes, it is six days a week. Michael Jordan said it himself, he used to do a lot of sprints to get his conditioning down, to run up and down the floor to, and to be dominant both on offense and defense. You have to be conditioned right. On Monday to Saturday, it is half court, full courts and stride workout, alternating, alternating every day. Now on these days, Michael Jordan will also play basketball. So if it seems like a little bit of cardio, you should take that in consideration. If you want to know how to do these workouts, I'll put instructions on the screen right now um, just so you can screenshot it or you can take a picture so you remember the workout and not be confused when you put down this routine. Remember to stretch your body to prevent injury. Conditioning injuries are a high risk if you do not stretch right, so make sure you stretch. You do not want to get hurt while conditioning. And that is basically it. Basketball wise, just practice the fundamentals and all the flashy stuff will come along with it. If you focus on conditioning and your weight training and your skills, the game will come naturally to you and you will see progress of a better player. My name is Shifty Dame and if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like it and subscribe with notifications to be notified when I post another bang video. Comment down below your thoughts or opinions on the video and thank you for watching and I'm out. Peace.